everybody and welcome to this video. My name is Christina and I want to share with you three tips that are immediately going to boost your confidence and you can apply right now. Tip number one. So, we are going to first talk about your gaze or about your head. It's really important where we are watching. Are we watching down? because we are too shy? Are we watching up because we are like full of ourselves, Or we just want to look comfortable, confident and sexy and good about us? So if you want to feel and look sexy, it's really important that our chin we bring in the alignment with the floor. So that means that we don't want to bring our head too much up or too much down, but down in alignment with the floor. So this is going to be a detail that you will try to think about to immediately look more beautiful and more confident. Tip number two, <laughs> your shoulders. Shoulders are really important when it comes to our entire posture. So if we really want to be aware uh, about where our shoulders are. Are we slouching down? Are we closing our chest? Or we are arching our back too much? Well, what is going to make us look much more uncomfortable and not too much natural? So basically what you want to do is you're going to do a circle with your shoulders. So you will go front, do a circle, go down and like really force to leave your shoulders down but also relax so you don't want to look like a like a stone right so we want to try to look as much as natural and comfortable we are so try to always hold your shoulders down relax if you're not sure just do this quick short exercise quick short move and bring your shoulders down Tip number three. So now we are going to talk about our abdomen or about our tummy. You don't want to go too much down, slouch again. Neither we want to too much arch our back, putting our bed, putting our uh, booty outside. So what we actually want to do, we want to bring our pelvic in the neutral position. By that, that means that you are going to bring your tummy back, right? You are going to squeeze, bring your pelvic in the neutral position and this is going to give you this nice align, uh, line of the posture that your head, your chest and your hip are all in one alignment. Now, how you can check do you have a good posture? It's super easy and super fast. You can do it in two ways. You can go to the wall surface, you can find some wall in your house, in your space, or maybe if you have some kind of stick, uh, in this case I don't have it now, but if you have, it's also good. But right now I'm going to show you this exercise, this quick and fast check on the wall, so let's go there. And now let's practice how to have a confident posture. As I said, we are going to come to the wall. So now you're going to stand like, I would say, I don't know, maybe two and a half centimeters. I'm not much good with the centimeters, <laughs> but let's say this is more or less it. So our feet are close, right? And you want to bring your, your head on the wall. As we said, your chin is parallel with the floor, not too much down, not too much up, so parallel with the floor. We are going to do a circle with your shoulders. You are going to relax, bring them down, bring your tummy like close in the neutral position. And if you have a good, correct posture, and if you're trying to bring your arms behind your back, you basically cannot. Well, actually, now it's bothering me my microphone. <laughs> And now, with this, you are sure that you have a beautiful, confident posture. And now you're going to do one step off the wall. And with this position, you can practice. And now, in your room, in your, in your house, just walk like this, in this position. And 
No, I know that it's much easier to say than do stuff. So that's why I'm here and I'm going to give you three exercises that are going to help you to build and to have this confident posture. Let's see which they are. First exercise. You can take elastic band if you have in your house. If you don't have, it's completely fine. You can improvise by taking a stick or even without a stick, but just like imitating and do exactly the same movement that I'm going to do. I'm going to show you from both sides, which you can actually see. Really important, try to mind your chin, your uh, posture, your chest, your tummy. So take the elastic band and you are going to bring your feet in the size of your shoulders, more or less. And you're going to bring your arms above your head. Also, try to keep your shoulders down. So engage your shoulder blades. Don't bring them up. This is not correct. So engage the shoulder blades and bring them up. And then we are going to bring our right leg back and go back in the center. Go up with your arm, back with your leg, and go back in the center. From next side, from this corner, let's do it. And go back and up, and back to the center. Back, and back to the center. You can repeat this exercise around 10 to 12 times. Second exercise that is also going to help you to open up your chest and to straighten your back muscles. Again, we are uh, using the same elastic band. Um, actually, this exercise is even more important that you have, but again, if you don't have, it's okay. Try to improvise. So we are going to bring in front of us elastic band. And what we are going to do, you are going to pull and stretch out this elastic band and bring your arms to the side and really engaging your shoulder blades like bringing them together and bring back to the center and pull and bring back to the center now i'm going to turn so that you can actually see the work of my shoulder blades this is a certain position the size of your feet the size of your shoulders and let's go and stretch you see how my shoulder blades are connecting together and relax so we are really pulling from our shoulder blades not from our hands and go again and go back, go again, and go back. So in this way, you are really engaging your muscle and open up your chest. And the last exercise is really, really similar to the second exercise. Bring your arms in front of your body, relax your shoulders, lay them down. And now we are going to do exactly the same movement, but just with uh, just on other side. So we will pull on our right side and go back to the center. On the left side, go back to the center. And again, and again. And now that you see the uh, sensations behind my back, how they look and how to feel. So really engage your shoulder blades and engage and go back. Let's go. Let's go. And that will be it. You have your three exercises. Try to do all of them, as I said, 10 to 12 a repetition. You can do it like two or three rounds, as you please, as you feel you want it. And I'm sure this is going to help you to have a beautiful, confident posture. Thank you so much for watching me. I hope you enjoy. And if you want to learn how to walk sexy in heels, click here. Or if you just want more tips about the confidence, click here and I'll see you there.